Oh, hello, friends. Today we have Multiverse by Jonesy. Hello. Normal 9x9 Sudoku rules apply. Draw a one cell wide loop that moves strictly orthogonally and doesn't branch or intersect itself. The loop doesn't touch itself, not even diagonally. I'm going to remember that. I'm going to remember that. We can't go back on itself even diagonally. The loop acts as a German whispers line. Oh, <gasps> whoa. Neighboring digits on the loop must have a difference of at least five. Okay, Jonesy was talking about a German Whispers puzzle that was posted, and I was scrolling through and not seeing any green lines. Um, but this makes sense. You have to make your own German Whispers line. <gasps> a digit in a circle indicates how many times that digit must appear in circles. The circle digits also indicate how many of the up to eight surrounding cells are on the loop. Circles are never on the loop. Okay, and then also digits separated by a white dot are consecutive. Digits separated by a black dot have a one to two ratio. Have fun. Okay, perfect. So um, I believe these are called counting circles, where um, if this is a three, there's also going to be two other threes somewhere in circles, right? Um, it also means, let's use pink. Of these eight cells, only three of them would be on the line. So it would be something like this, right? Um, that would work. Okay. Oh my gosh. It's also a German Whispers. It's also a German whisper line. Uh, no given digits. How do we want to get started? Probably with circles, I imagine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Um, so the digits in the circles have to sum to ten. We could have nine and one. We can't have nine and one because there's some regions that don't have any circles. And we still have to follow Sudoku rules. Um, how many different numbers can we have? One, two, or I guess, how many times can the same digit appear? That's what, uh, that's what I really want to know. Um, one, two, three, four, five, or five. That might be the most. If I do this one and this one, this is only two columns. So even though it's three regions, it's still only two numbers. So like one, two, a third could go here, four, five. As long as they don't, I mean, they kind of line up. Is that actually possible? One, two, three, four, five. Yes. But both of these are on a black crop key, so you actually can't use five. Can I get five fives? No. Because I, I can't use either one of these. I could do one here. I could do one here. One here. One here. That's only four. I might have to do one, two, three, four. I think the circles might be one, two, three, four. They can really... The biggest number I can use is four. Um, I can't actually use fives because there's only four different spots they can go since I can't use this for fives. I think these circles are going to be one, two, three, four. Um, which is really cool because high, low shading for the German whisper line will be really nice knowing that there's some low digits in set places already. Um, this can't be a three because I don't have a six here. Also, the circles are never on the loop. This will definitely be a two. Um, do, does four have to go in set places? If I do a four here and a four here, a four in one of these, that's three of them. And I could, no, I have some options for four. What if I think about four and three? Four, okay, four and three together needs to take up seven of the circles. They could both go here, so that would be two circles. Four could go here. That's a third circle. They could both go in here. That's um, four, five, six, seven. Ooh, does it need to work that way? Another way to look at it, if a four goes here, if I do four, 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 and then I do Three, three, three. Yeah. Um, 
I think these just have to be three, four. If there are one or two, there aren't enough places for the three and the four. Um, also, a three will definitely be in one of these, and a three will definitely be in one of these. And a four has to go here then. And a four will go in one of these, and a four will go in one of these. So this is definitely two, four. Um, Can I narrow it down more than that? One of these is definitely a three. One of these is definitely a four. One of them is a one or a two. Two is already set, so I can only have one more two, and I can have one one. Perfect. Um, maybe they're kind of limited with the line, actually. This is a loop. I should call it a loop and not a line. There's not a beginning and an end. So, like, I'm going to have to be careful around the corners, right? I can't go in this corner at all. There's no way back out if it can't touch itself and it only moves orthogonally. I also can't go in here. If I can't go on the circles at all, I could I could draw X's on the circles, but I'll, we'll just remember that. So, it's the number in the circle is how many cells of the eight surrounding it are on the loop. Okay. So this can't even be a four. There are only three cells that could be on the loop. So a four will have to go here or here and here or here. Um, meaning for boxes one and four, we have a four. We have our fours. There's going to be a four here for sure. I mentioned shading for high-low and then I didn't. Let's actually, um, I want to draw a green line for German Whispers. And we'll do high, low as pink and orange. Orange feels more low to me, but pink is on the left. So high, low, or low, high. I set it backwards. I'm going to get mixed up now. It makes sense to me that low is on the left and high is on the right, even though to me, orange is more of a low number when I actually get to decide and it's not ambiguous until the middle. Um, what else do I want to look at? Um, one of these is definitely a four. One of them is definitely only a two, which might be difficult with them being right next to each other. Like, what if this is a two and this is a four? Actually, I think I could just do this and it would be fine. Yeah, this is four cells for this and two cells for this. That'd be fine. Um, I'd have to figure out how to get way back up here, but I, something like this would be fine. Nope, it wouldn't. I take it back. We'll figure something out there. Um, maybe I want to look at the fact that one of these has to be a four. They're pretty open, though. There's a lot of space around them. Oh, it has to be a German Whispers line, and I've already used three low numbers in here that can't be on the line. Um, so digits in here. Oh, I can't. Okay, there's a lot of things I'm realizing really quickly. Um, first, we got we to gotta make sure I, I say everything out loud so I remember it. In box five, circles can't go on the loop. And also, I only have one more low number that can be on the loop. So I can only have one, two, or three of these open cells on the loop. But I can't use both of these like this because consecutive literally means it won't have a difference of at least five. So I'm not going to be able to draw the line through these white crappies. Okay, um, so I could use one of these, but not both of them together like that. Actually, not both at all. Um, because even if I were to go like this and come back, that would mean the line's touching it. The loop, that would mean the loop is touching itself, and we don't want that to happen. So there might be a certain way this loop has to go through box five. Uh, I could go like this or something. We'll come back to that maybe, but that's a, a good thing to think about that I needed to be a German Whispers and I'm limited on my low numbers in here. One of these has to be a four. 
I didn't check if all the other numbers. I checked that this could not be a four, but I didn't check anything else. This could be a four. This could be a four. Um, two and four, I kind of looked at. I see how it would work just looking at these two, but the interaction with this might make things difficult. Um, seems reasonable that this could have four. Maybe if I went like this. Um, maybe same thing here. That's not what I wanted. Like this. Just remember, I can't go that way. Maybe... Okay, one of these will definitely be a four. Is there some overlap? If this is four... I'm definitely using these cells. This has to go somewhere, so it has to go this way. This has to go somewhere. It can't go back and touch the loop again, so it'll have to go this way. Then it'll have to go this way. Then I have options. Um, this would have to go this way. So this is how the line would work if this is a four, at least. Um, this would have to keep going. It can't go down. If this is a four, it at least goes like this. Um, if this is a four, we would go like this. This has to go somewhere. It would go up. This has to go somewhere. It can't go this way. It would go up again. Has to go somewhere. It would go this way. Has to go somewhere. It would go up again. Um, now I could go this way or this way. But this is going to be a three no matter what. Whether this is the four or this is the four. If this is a four, this is definitely a three. If this is a four, this is at least a two. So this can't be a one. This can't be a one, two. The blue and green overlap, we're definitely going to have line there, though. Okay. Um, definitely there. Um, This does need to go high, low, high, low, high, low. Maybe I want to shade. Pink and orange can be for what I know is high, low. Or maybe I can see these are low. Let's do pink and orange for this. That way I don't have to decide which one's high and which one's low yet. But it will go high, low, high, low, high, low. Um, we're getting limited on where fives can go also. A five would have to go here somewhere. We have a Luna sighting. Luna showed up. Are you going to stay here? Are you leaving? <gasps> Luna, the comments have been asking about you, though. You're not staying today? She's like, I'm over it. It's the cat version of rolling her eyes. Okay, you can leave. She might go eat some food and then come back, honestly. All right, where was I? Um, both of these already have two, so one of them can't grow anymore. Okay. Um, if pink is low, these are already all the low numbers. Actually, one of these is going to be orange. So that's already, whether low is orange or low is pink, we already have all of the low numbers. Here, here, and then here, here, or here, here. Okay. So, I mean, I, I don't want to go like this. Well, pink could be high and that would be fine. Hmm. Same thing here. After this is going to be a pink. So, whether pink or orange is low or high. Okay, so...
they can't both go like this because whether orange is pink or whether orange is pink whether orange is high whether orange is low or pink is low they can't both go like this at the ends of the loop right here that would be too many numbers um that's something to think about Hmm. What more can I do here? What about ignoring the line for a second? What more can I do with these circles? Can I say where the other two has to go? gonna go somewhere here seems like it's still possible or the one the one has options this could be just a one if the line goes like this that would be fine Okay, possibilities, if this is 2 and this is 4, the line would have to go up here and then off somewhere. Could not go here at all. But I would need to get 4 here. So to get 2 more, I would have to go this way. Seems possible. Seems fine. This would be a 4. This would be a 2. This would have to be a 3. Okay, so how can I get from here back down to here? I would have to go like this. Oh, it would be broken. It would be broken. Because this doesn't have anywhere to go. It can't go up here. And it can't go up here because I can't go through there. Oh, wait, what if I just go like this? It's not broken. I think it could work. Nope. That's diagonal. I don't think it I don't think it works. This is a very rough sketch, but if I go this way, I can't get 3 down here. It would either touch the line back here this is diagonal for that reason i don't think this can be four if this is four i can't go this way at all this would be locked in at two I think either way, since one of these is two, I can't go this way at all. Um, that would, both of those cells would increase both of those circles. And I don't want to do that. So I definitely can't go through these cells. Um, I don't have to visit each region. I probably will visit this region in order for these circles. I mean, I guess I don't have to, but. If I don't have to, I shouldn't say that I probably will. Okay. Um. I'm going to sketch a few more. If this is four, it absolutely has to go this way. If this is four, this is not four. So this is four. This can't be two. There's no way. 
Yeah, there's no way to only get two here. No, I could go like this. Shoot. I was thinking I would end up having to go like this or something. I could have two if it goes like this. Man. Um, but if this is a four, this is not a four. So this is a four. Could this be a three? If this is a four, could this be a three? I think this would be stuck at a two. Oh, actually, the line I had drawn earlier, where it ended up breaking anyways because it would touch itself, if I make this a three, this cell is also seen by this one. So they'd both, they'd both be three. That's another reason why it won't work. Okay, I think I'm convinced this has to be two and this has to be four. So this is going to be a three, uh, meaning this will not be a three or a two. It'll be a four. This cannot be a three. This will be a, um, nope, that breaks. Oh, well, there's one way to say if this is a two, this is a four, this is a three. So this can't be a two or a three. So it'd be a four. Oh, this could be an eight, Kathy. I don't need to use one, two, three or four here. This could be an eight. Um, that could be an eight. I was thinking this was on a circle just like this was, but it's not. Uh, this can't be a three. This is for sure a four though, um, which means I'm probably going to take the line this way and we can say that orange is high. This can't be four. This can't be two. This can't be four. So it is a three. Um... This needs to be a four. And this needs to be a four. Those are our four fours. We have two threes. One of these will be a three. And then the other one will be a one, two. This will be a one, two. Perfect. Um, the line will, I was doing black for what was locked in, but I just want to make it green. This is definitely three, so this will go this way. Um, it'll go this way again in order to make this a four. This needs to be a four, so I'm definitely going to go this way. So this is a one right now. Um, this is complete. I don't want to go any further this way. Very cool. Shading on the line. This would end up being orange and this would be pink. This would be pink and this would be orange. I don't know if I'm going to go further, but I definitely won't go all the way down here. Um, I don't want to go further. Just kidding. I take it back. I'm going to say I can't go this way, but I could go this way. That'd be cool. If this is an eight, this needs to be a six, seven, nine. This needs to be a six, seven, nine. This needs to be a six, seven, nine. This could also be an eight. This needs to be 679. These are going to be low numbers, a 1, 2, 3, 4, but they see a 3 and a 4. This one also can't be a 2, so it's a 1. So this is a 2. Um, this needs to be a 1, 2, 3, 4, but it sees 2, 3, and 4, so it's a 1, which makes this a 2. Perfect. Um, this needs to be a 1, 2, 3, 4. It sees 1, 2, 4, so it's a 3. This needs to be 1, 2, 3, 4. Sees a 3 and a 2. And a four. So this is a one. It sees a four over here. Um, three makes this an eight. Three would have to make this a nine. It can't be a six or a seven. One and two. If this is a two, these won't be six. Seven, eight, nine is fine. This is a one, so the six, seven, eight, nine is fine. Let me get rid of my X's. Made a Scott Pilgrim joke when I said that the other day on stream. Um, and this can't go that way, but that's fine. This won't go that way. This needs to go one more. So we're going to bring it down this way. This will be orange now. Um, after a one, this could be a six, seven, eight, nine. It won't be an eight because of Sudoku. But then I don't want to go further down. I'm going to want to go right so that this stays only a two. 
I can't go up because it would touch the line again. I can't go through this dot, so it's going to go down. Can't go backwards, so I'm going to go right. Um, can't go up, this would touch the line again, so I'm going to go right. Now I have options again. So if I finish shading, these are orange and these are pink. Uh, these are one, two, three, fours because they're low. This sees one and two and four, so it's a three. I mean, this can't be a six or seven, it's a nine. This does not see anything. Oh, wow. This would have to be an eight or a nine. It's going to be an eight because it can't be a nine. This can't be a four. This needs to be a six, seven, eight, nine. Can't be an eight because of Sudoku. But six, seven, nine would be fine, um, depending on what this is. I'm going to go ahead and shade the circles now. Since I know what they are, they ended up being pink anyways. This is a 9 now, so this is a 7. I mean, this is not a 7 or a 9, it's an 8. If this is a 7, this is not a 7. This is high 5. Ooh, we can look at where 5s can go. High 5. This is high and 5. We need a four in here. It can't go here. It can't go where we already have digits and it can't go here. So this is a four. Four low digits. Whoa, four low digits, four low digits. Almost four low digits. What else? Um, can I place more fours? One, two, three, four, five. I need a four in here. Can't go here, can't go here, can't go here. Oh, this needs to be consecutive with a three. This will be either a two or a four. It can't be a two, so it is a four. Okay, nice. I forgot about dots for a second. Um, we need a four over here. Can't go here, can't go here, can't go here. So one of these is a four. A four in here. Can't go here. Can't go here. Can't go here. So one of these is a four. And then we also need a four in here. It just can't go there right now. Oh, or there, actually. So one of these is a four. Threes? We need a three in here. It can't go here or here. Uh, one of these will definitely be a three. So one of these will definitely be a three. I should center mark. Oh, um, we have twos in circles. So this is going to be... A one three pair. Perfect. I forgot. So three in here. Can't go here. No, I don't really know much. Just kidding. I know a lot. I just don't know where these numbers can go. I have options. Hmm. We could consider... I kind of want to mark off the ones that I've completed. Oh, it's a little hard to see that, I feel like. Is there a better way of doing that? It makes sense. Okay, back to circles. The loop needs to touch this in four places. It needs to touch this in three places. One of these is a three and one of these is a one. Um, I It would be really helpful to mark where the line can't come back. This would be diagonal to this. I don't want anything else around this. So my option, if this can't be a three anymore, this will have to be the one then. And this will have to be a three. 
One being either this one or this one. It can't go through here. I also can't access this spot anymore. So the line's going to have to go through here. Um, if I went like this, that would be nice. And this will probably be a low number. This will probably be a two. So I need to go high, low, high if I'm going to have three cells in here. I think that's the only way it'll end up working. Ooh, what do I do with this, though? Or with this, I mean. Uh-oh. I think I marked this off too early. Actually? I could go up from here, and that would be totally fine. I marked this off because I left this spot already. But this could go up, and I could go here. And it would be fine if I did this. That would be three for this, and one for this. And that would be cool. This needs to have four. If I went like this, this already has three. I'd probably continue to there. Does it have to work this way? I need to prove it. <laughs> I need to prove it before I keep drawing. Um, whatever comes after this needs to be pink. So if it goes this way, it would be a one. It sees two, three, four already. That means none of this can be a low number. If it goes this way, I have options. If I draw the line this way, though, I would have to continue and go this way again. I think in order for this three to work, if I can't pass through here, there isn't a way I can only get like one cell up here. If I go through here, it has to be like this. Um, if I go through here, it's because I went this way. So I think it has to be these three. I feel pretty confident about that. I think that's the only way it works. And then, I, of course, I can't go through that dot, so it has to go this way. This is going to be pink, this is going to be pink, this is going to be pink. These are going to be orange. These are one, two, three, four. None of them can be four, actually. Um, this can't be three. This also can't be a two, so it is a one. So this is not a one. This can't be a one. This can't be a one. It is a two. Next to a one, we can have anything. A two or a three means this can't be a six. A seven or nine. A seven's fine if this is a two. This needs to be a six seventy nine. Um, everything is fine for Sudoku, but we're going to have at least a two here. So this becomes a seven. <gasps> Luna came back. Hey, bud. Nope, she ran away when I tried to pick her up. Um, this is definitely a two. This is at least a two. So this would be seven, eight, nine. It can't be an eight because of this. Okay, so... This has one next to it, and this has three next to it, meaning I don't want to go this way anymore. Um, which means I can't make it in here. This is done, and this is done. Clean up some of these X's, because I know I can't go this way anymore. I need one more here.
There's no way I can go down like this. There's no way I can get to any of these. So I think it's just going to be this one. There's our fourth one. This. I can't get here. So this only has five cells to get to. I can't use this one anymore, actually, because I went this way. So it's going to be these four cells. I don't want to be hasty, but I could just go ahead and connect it like this. That would work. This needs to go somewhere. If I need to go through these four cells, this needs to go somewhere. It's going to go up. It can't go like this because that would come back on itself. So this is going to go like this. Um, this needs to go somewhere and it can't go here because that'd be touching the line. So it's going to go this way. I can't keep going further because this is only three. So I'm going to go down and then they're going to meet. I could have been hasty. We could have assumed. We have our line drawn. Um, very nice. Let's clean up some spots so I can see better. And we have um, Sudoku to finish up now. Um, pink, 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 pink. Perfect. Orange, 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 orange. Oranges are six, seven, eight. Whoops. How do I do that? Pink is one, two, three, four. This can't be an eight because of this. This could be anything. These can't be eight because of this. This can't be a seven. Um, this can't be a two or a three, but a four is fine. This can't be a one, two, four, so it is a three, meaning this is not a three. Um, this can't be a three, a four, or a two, so it's a one. This can't be a one, a three, but two, four is still fine. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. We need a three here. A three here, a three here. Where can three go here? Can't go here, can't go here. Can't go here. One of these is a three. Okay. Where can three go in here? Um, I should finish cleaning up the line before I start looking at threes. If this is a one, six, eight, nine is fine. This is at least a two, though, so this actually can't be a six. It's just an eight, nine. If this is at least a two, this can't be a six either. This is a three, so this can't be a six or a seven. It's a nine. Meaning this is a seven. Um, meaning this can't be a four. So it is a two. This is a four. This is a two and a one. Eight, nine is fine. If this is a three, this can't be a six or a seven. Um, this is a two, so this can't be a six. That looks almost good to me. Um, this is a nine. Two or three is fine. This is at least a two, so sevens are fine here. Just with Sudoku, can I do any more? Does this see a two or three, or does this see a two or three? Hi, Luna. Do you want me to pick you up? She ran away and went, meow. I think she's trying to say no. Do you think my cat can talk, guys? Luna, can you talk? She went, meow. We have not placed any fives. That's another thing to think about. There's definitely a five here. So five would have to go here, here. You can look at that in a second. Can I not do any more with this line? This is a consecutive number. Can't be one, two, can't be two, three, can't be three, four. Could be five, six. Could be six, seven. Won't be seven, eight. That would break this. But this definitely has a six in it.
this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And this is not five, six, seven. Actually, this can't be a seven. This is a seven, so this is not a seven. This is a seven, meaning this is not a seven. So this is a seven. This is a five, six pair, meaning we can say what this is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This is a five, six. This is going to be a five, six. This got messy. If this is a seven, this would be a six or an eight. If it's a nine, this would be an eight. Both, uh, they're not still fine. This has to be a six. So this is an eight. I mean, this could be a seven or a nine. These are orange. Does that clean anything up? I don't think so. I think I have to keep going with pencil marks. This is a 5-6, so this is a 5-6. I'm looking. Oops. I'm going to look at fours. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We need a four here, and we need a four in here. Same thing. Okay, I'm going to keep going with pencil marks until I notice something, probably. Eight has to go here or here, but I can't say which one. Looking around for more stuff like that. Yeah, okay, um, pencil marks. We have one, two, three, four. We have a six for sure. This is either a five, a seven, or an eight. Looks fine to be any of those. Five, six, seven, eight, quadruple. This is going to be a two, three, nine. This can't be a three. Okay. This is a five, six, seven. This would also be a five, six, seven. And this is a really bad spot to start pencil marking. There's nothing here. Let's look instead. Huh. I don't Two can be seven or nine. If this is a four, these would have to both be nine. So this can't be a four. This is a one. This is a four. This is a four. If this is a three, this could be nine, eight. That would be okay. If this is a three, this works out to be eight, nine. This is a one now, so any of these work. Yeah, I think so. Um, a good place to pencil mark. I kind of still have a lot of empty space. I might just have to start somewhere. This row still needs a two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This can't be a two. This can't be a two. So this is a two, meaning this is a five, six pair for the row. Um, both are still able to be 5, 6 because of the columns and the regions. This region needs a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9. This can't be a 7 or a 9, so it's a 5, 6 pair, meaning this will be 7, 9. Which it can be both of those. 5, 6, 5, 6, 7, 9, 8, 9. This will be a 7, 8, 9. Why was 6 afraid of 7? Oh, 
<gasps> this is a two, so this is a three. This is a two. Meaning sevens still work here. This is a nine, so this can't be a nine. Uh, and we're a three, so or a two, so this is a three. If this is a nine, then this is a seven, and this is an eight. Meaning this is a nine. Five, six has not changed. This is a seven, so this is a nine. So this is a seven. I mean, this can't be a seven. I just alt tabbed. Um, I just alt tabbed. This was a seven, so this is a seven, not a seven. Um, meaning nothing. This is a five eight. Five six seven five six five eight seven eight. One of these is definitely a seven. Five six five eight eight nine. Five six. Five six seven. This is gonna be five six seven, but it can't be sevens, but there is another digit we still need in the column. A three, it looks like. This can't be a three, so this is a three. This can't be a six, actually, so it's a five. Meaning this is not a five, it's a six, seven. This is a five. Um, this is an eight. This is not a five, it's a six. This is not a five or a six, it's a seven. This is a five, meaning this is a six, and this is a five, and this is a six, and this is a five. Um, this is a five and this is a six, so this is a five and this is a six. Six, seven are up here and don't affect this. This row still needs one, two, three, four, five, six. This is a five, so this is a six, and this is a five. This is eight, nine, so this is eight, nine, but this is a nine, so this is an eight, and this is a nine which is fine for the German whisper line. I think all the digits are filled in on this line now. Cool. Very cool. This region still needs one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight can't go up here and neither can six. So this is gonna be a six, eight. Um, I don't have a six or an eight. Oh, I do, that's a six. So this is an eight, this is a six. One, two, seven. This is going to be a two. Okay, these are one sevens. This. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This can't be a five and eight. Six, seven still. For the row, this can't be a two. A one, five, six, seven, eight for the rows, still fine. Column says this can't be an eight or five, nine, four, six. This is a seven, then none of these can be seven anymore. Meaning this is a one and this is a two. This is a seven. If this is a two, then these can't be two. So this is a one six pair. So this is a seven and this is a six. Um, this is an eight, so this is a five and this is an eight. This is a six and this will be a one. Let's make all the digits the right color. Uh, we didn't shade fives. Sixes are orange, eights are orange. I misshaded something the last time I did a coloring puzzle. And somebody called me out in the comments. I had no idea I even missed it. I thought I did well. I just did it again because I started talking. Pink. I think everything's good now. I have to double check. One, two, three, four. 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 Good thing I double checked. Six seven eight nine six seven eight nine six seven eight nine. I can't get any comments about it. I have to check six seven eight nine. 
Very cool. Very cool. Your vacuum cleaning robot sucks. Very nice puzzle. I like these um, drawing the loop ones. I think this might be the first one where I had to draw a line that was also a German. Was no. I think the other one I did was by Jonesy also actually that I did on stream once. That was pretty cool. Um, very nice puzzle. The German whisper totally threw me full for a loop here. That wasn't even supposed to be punny. I'll just stop talking now. Very nice puzzle. Let me know how you did in the comments.